please let me go, Mom. Look at me. I need to show you he's not Danny, dead. Danny, he's not Danny, dead in there. Come, come Did you see him? The couch. Did you see him? Did you look yes. at him? Yes. I saw him. I came home and I found him. He was dying. So he was still alive, Mom? He was, he, was, he was still alive. I called the paramedics. I tried to get him to hold on, but I couldn't. He's dead. No. So sorry, sweetheart. He's gone. Dad, where were you? Okay. I went to see your mother. You went to see mom? Where? At the cemetery. I went to her grave. You mean after you had it dug up? Okay, okay, Shane, I'm so sorry about that. You have every right to be upset about what I did. You, you, you just need to know that I... You what? I, I was chasing after something that led nowhere. So tonight, I went back to the grave just to make sure that she was peaceful and safe from the storm. So I, I rearranged a few things and replanted some of the stuff that we put there, and I told her how sorry I was. For digging her up? Yeah, for tr trying too hard to make things right, for doing something that I shouldn't have done. Something she would have talked me out of doing. Dad? Look, I'm so sorry, Shane. I'm, I'm very sorry for what I did. I'm sorry too, Dad. For what? Dad did not shoot Stop. Victor Dad. He wouldn't do something like that. Joy and safe. Why else would he do that? He wanted my dad's dead. I don't dead. know that he did it. What does it matter? At least Star's happy now, right? Aren't you happy my dad's dead? <laughs> How dare you speak to your sister? Forget about dead. her. Why don't you tell me to get to find Scarface and haul him in? You know, at a time like this, you'd think you'd stop acting like a jerk. We have an APB out on five men, but it's too early in the investigation to start focusing on one person. Are you serious? Jack, stop it. At this time, we have no eyewitnesses. We do not have the murder weapon. All we have is your keys at the scene. Shane? I'm sorry about being so mad at you before about what happened with Mom's grave and for yelling at you for not going after Jack and his dad. Shane, you have nothing to be sorry for. To be honest, I needed to hear that. What you said was perfect. You're perfect. No, Dad, I I'm not. Whoa, 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 what's wrong? Is somebody picking on you again? Huh? Is it Jack? Okay. Do you want to check on Star? I'm afraid to leave Jack right now. Jack's going to tell me what happened tonight. Maybe it'll be better for just the two of us. Right. Just don't. Uh, just go easy, all right? I'll be outside. Jack. I, I can take care of myself, Mom. No, no one's picking on me. I don't know why I said that. I, I guess I'm just tired or something. Well, then you need to get some sleep, kiddo. I can't. I'm too wound up. Okay. Uh, uh, do you want something to drink? Hot chocolate or something? Hot chocolate? I don't know. Help me out here. Well, sometimes at our old house, you'd be asleep and Mom would be downstairs watching some cheesy late-night movie. If I couldn't sleep, I'd go downstairs and watch it with her. How many times I'd wake up and find you both asleep in front of the TV? Those were, like, my best times with Mom. Well, I'm not mom. No one could ever be. But hey, let's see what we can do, okay? Hmm? This is Blanca Morales from WVL News, broadcasting live from the home of Victor Lord Jr. And it looks like they're bringing out the body now. What happened to you tonight? 
How'd your keys end up at a murder scene? How'd you end up alone and unconscious outside the ER? 